I've had a pretty big day today. I'm just at home now. <clears throat> just knocking out a bit of dinner. <clears throat> it's, um, we had an idea of doing a place, at, uh, the next painting at a place called, um, Jeti Louis. Uh, it's quite hard to say. Um, it's up in the mountains. It's a terrace, it's a terrace rice field. It's about two hours drive from, from where we are in Chenggu. And, um, we headed off up there and, um, found an unbelievable spot. It's kind of a, you know, it's almost like a hut. We we're actually going to take a mattress up and stay there for, for five days. Take computers and the cameras and everything like that. And about 100 metres down the road is a little restaurant or a shack restaurant where we can recharge stuff. So we want to start there. So we found it and then we started asking who owned the land and we had to find out like most locations of how do we how do we actually get that place to, to paint we found out that the guy that actually owns that little shack um, was in his home village praying for the for the day it was his it was his time to go back to his village so we kind of got talking to Marday and he said look you know there's a really cool um, temple um, up at the lake which is the lakes inside the volcano if you want to go take a look at that one is maybe a possible location so we chuffed off out there which is about another hour up further into the mountains and yeah we got there and it, it is the most amazing the most amazing place it's um it's on the 50,000 rupee note I don't know oh yeah I do that's it there and um yeah it's a pretty special place so we kind of went out there and as soon as we got there that like everything the vibe of the place was just was awesome. I was just, I was so pumped to get there and and paint. And uh, the longer we stayed there, and the, the the place, like the more we realised how special the place was to the local people and, and to the Balinese. It, I kind of figured maybe it wasn't going to happen just because it was it was like a like a pretty special place to the, to those guys. So a sacred place anyway. We end up sitting down with a committee who looks after the, the whole area and they were keen as, they were just like, yeah, no worries and we didn't have to pay any money and we basically got to set up right in front of the temple. The temple's actually situated in the lake and we're literally on the side. Um, yeah, so we've got it for like the next four or five mornings. The idea is to get up there at like 4 a.m and then and paint to like 10 11 and then the clouds come over and it gets really misty and you can't see anything so yeah the idea is to be getting up getting up and driving up there each morning and and uh and, and painting so yeah it's um it's, it's like best it's going to be one of the best places ever like it's just the whole vibe of it just feels unreal so yeah we're um just knocking up with dinner i'm going to chuff up tomorrow so we've got an early start um 3.30 when I wake up and, and head off out of here. So we'll get everything set tonight and and then chuff. <clears throat> so yeah, we get stuck into this dinner.